Are you prepared for a major solar storm? World will have just 12 hours warning if the sun erupts. The scientists can give us only 12 hours notice if a dangerous explosion from the surface of the sun heads our way, informed us the latest report from NASA. There has been developed and published a plan for extreme situations, such as a space weather, by the British government, evidencing what we have to be doing in order to cope with such a situation. NASA had also informed that a massive solar activity will interrupt transport networks, will cause blackouts and also disrupt satellite. The most harmful event that will happen is a major coronal mass ejection, where huge eruptions of high-energy particles would be sent into the space. There will also be major solar flames, as a consequence of the magnetic energy blasts of radiation sent across the solar system. The report states, Space weather results from solar activity. Solar activity can produce X-rays, high-energy particles and coronal mass ejections of plasma. Where such activity is directed towards Earth there is the potential to cause wide-ranging impacts. These include power loss, aviation disruption, communication loss, and disturbance to, or loss, of satellite systems. The most recent major coronal mass ejection to hit the Earth, Carrington event, had been a powerful geomagnetic storm, in 1859 and it might be the biggest in over 500 years. Even if at that time technology was still way behind nowadays, their telegraph systems all over the world had failed, and electricity pylons short-circuited. A large flare sent by the sun this year in March had failed radio transmissions in some parts of the world. The UK government space weather preparedness strategy said that for a sun blast to reach Earth might take 18 hours. But he also added, It is therefore likely that our reasonable worst-case scenario would only allow us 12 hours from observation to impact. The strategy warns that while the UK power network would likely be able to cope with a major space weather event, other countries are less well prepared, it said. The GB power grid is likely to be more resilient than that of some other countries to the effects of severe space weather for a range of reasons, shorter power lines, a mesh-like grid system with the ability to close sections and route power around them and, a more reliant design for new and replacement transformers. Nonetheless, for the GB grid, our relatively high latitude, long coastline and geology are factors that increase risk. Their main recommendation is for everyone to be preparing for a solar storm as much as for other natural disasters such as flooding or major storms. The report also informs us regarding that the GPS signal will be down, and the drivers should carry a map with them to help them navigate while GPS network is down. Mobile network and landline services are unlikely to be affected, meaning that these still can be used. They also inform us that power and communication infra should be updated to include backups so that nobody loses their data. Companies and emergency services are urged to have plans in place to deal with the impacts too.